welcome back to my channel so it's a little bit of an owl for you uh to be honest i can't remember what the heck it is <laughs> i've got that many different videos on my phone i've just not had chance to put any of them together and i thought i'm gonna have to put some on for you aren't I? but you can see i've been to asda i've got a little bit of shopping on here and remember getting them gold coins actually them christmas coins and they were only 40p or something when they went through till none of this is still in my house not even rubbish is still outside in bins it were <laughs> it were eaten about two weeks ago or something but it was just a top-up shop and i thought i'd just show you it i got some korma spice pots to make a curry uh yeah <laughs> you had any cream to it as i remember i actually made korma last night but it were aldi ones then a balty one they were nice i don't know where it my dress care <laughs> um i got some dunkers for pat lunch as well two cheese and tomato pizzas there which i think i just made as an extra on dinner or didn't want main thing i were cooking because yeah i am that divvy that makes about 10 different dinners on a night to suit everyone but yeah those bag of chocolate coins it were all really reduced in asda um so i did pick up those i think millie were with me if i remember right and she was like oh can we get them so yeah i've just been a bit out of sorts to be honest with you a bit no energy for anything and i'm just well dave's built two beds upstairs our bed and then the bunk beds and then the all upstairs is now just such a mess but between dave going back to work school runs me having the baby and stuff and just not being a hundred percent i've not managed to sort any of it out so my upstairs and my house is just something else i've just got piles and piles of clothes everywhere and bedding that just loads of it needs to go because i've just you know a lot of it you're gonna laugh it's stuff that i've got to slim into that i thought i won't get rid of that i'll get in that one day i've got no chance <laughs> um i've got no willpower i'm just an absolute mess um so i don't know i might keep some of my favorite bits but i'm just gonna send rest at charity shop because I just can't keep so much stuff in my house it's just not big enough we have a seven bedroomed house where it's it sounds massive and it's not they're all really tiny rooms and yeah i just can't wait to move to be honest but we've got two pots of those um pasta pot things the two for three pound fifty and they're just great again there's an extra mainly for shane or sometimes with boys are just hungry later on at night because all it's boys that are raided in the fridge well i'm behind them like <laughs> but you know they uh, they do like those we get a massive bag of peppers because they're only about three quid and uh and it might be cheaper than that actually but you get loads and we like the green ones to put in like chilies and spaghetti bolognese and stuff i've got a stack of naan breads there little mini naan breads for making curry and some chilies to put in our chili <laughs> and squirty cream for hot chocolate some ham some turkey they're back on two for three pound i'm sure and i think this is what i'm actually telling you here because it wore a proper all but just voiced over it um but i'm sure they used to be two for three fifty and they're two for three pound now got warburton's you know i do love a blow for warburton's even though i shouldn't do really because i'm pregnant and i have gestational diabetes i've actually said yeah you've got it now so They've put me on metformin but i've not even picked it up i've not even started my injections that i should be on or aspirin or anything i'm honestly just i need to sort it out i know <laughs> um but i went to hospital yesterday and i were in there three hours and by the time she gave me my prescription my parking had run out so i wasn't able to get my thing from pharmacy i got cornflakes because they were so cheap aren't they like 85p and kids have got a thing for cornflakes so i feel like yeah i'm winning here <laughs> they don't want the four pound box of crave they want the 85p cornflakes I would pay £4.50 for them. I wouldn't. They were reduced to a pound a box, so I got a couple of them. And as you can see, there's all them pancakes, and they were all £10 a packet. They had trays and trays full of them. And looking back, I think, why didn't I buy more? Because I always think, oh, I can't get too many. Like those little cake things there, you know, them ones with cherry on top, what they're called, macaroni things. I got them and they were about 30p, I think I showed you. But all them pancakes were 10p a pack, so I put them all in the freezer and they've done kids all week for the um, breakfast. Well, they've had porridge, cornflakes and, and them. Not all three, but whatever I could, you know, whatever each one wanted. But I've still got a couple of packs in the freezer, but I just wish I'd have bought more of them because mine really do enjoy pancakes with a bit of butter on and sugar or the like, um, just with a bit of chocolate spread or the... Um, golden syrup i've still got that in my freezer actually the, i got that for my eggs on the morning you know the whole meal bread 
not even used it. If I'm honest with you, I had white bread, didn't I? But my sugars have been fine because I've had eggs with it. So you have protein with the carb and they were okay actually with that. So if I had toast on its own, it probably wouldn't be, but we're all right with eggs. I've got some yogurts, mainly for Lucas, but Caitlin has taken some in a packed lunch. I can't remember if Millie did. Um, but I've still got a couple of those left. I've only got a couple of days left on them now. So I'll up today. Um, Daniel's barbecue sauce in the background. Because if you know me and me alls, you know how much my son loves his barbecue sauce. He goes nuts if I ain't got any in. I think I told you that. Anyway, I do buy him barbecue sauce. It might be sometimes when I don't think. But yeah, he does. He likes the Aldi one and he likes the um, the other brand. Heinz. Is it Heinz one? I've got some big oranges, which little Lucas loves chopped up. And bloody baby bells. Sick of fucking think baby bell. They're something that you, got, like you can eat on the gestational diabetes but i don't even like him but you know if you just want him to grab some i think oh, i'll eat one what lie i did have some of the cheesy garlic cheesy things in mcdonald's yesterday because like, well, i was in hospital one i and costa was shut i couldn't believe it not that i could have really had out in there either but yeah i went straight through drive through didn't i i know i'm just a big state <laughs> i've got eggs a uh, tray of eggs they've all gone just eggs galore you know so it's <laughs> one of the things you can eat um, kids do love eggs and because Jacob's still not back in school they've still not rung me with his school place and I've rung them, emailed them still not getting anywhere he has got a place but they're just not telling us when he can go back in the meantime I'm still like, paying for his bus and everything I've got two lots of um, sausages they did I think a breakfast or summer. I think I bought them thinking I'd chop them up and put them in pasta and you know, try and think of cheaper meals to do because you get two for £5 but um, I don't think I ended up doing that. I think we just made sausage sandwiches for whoever wanted one. I've got butter and some uh, fake Oreos, strawberries, grapes. They've all gone. Potatoes have gone. The milk's gone. Oh shit, I've got to tell Dave to get milk from the shop. He went, he took kids to the shop because he picked them up tonight, got home early from work for me because I've been feeling really off of it and so he got home early. And then. Um, he went and took kids to the shop, but I forgot to tell him milk. I've just remembered now seeing it on a bloody all. Um, yeah, strawberries, wedges, coleslaw, cream. They were 50p a box, the birthday cake cereal bars. So I got some of them. I got a lemon one. I got the spicy little meatballs, but do you know what? They turned to mush when I cooked them. I don't know why, they just didn't stay meatball shaped. <laughs> but, um, I don't know why I'm turning round. I must have been showing you some of that. Big tray of chicken that's ten pound. That did the curry, um, because I actually only bought a smaller tray and ended up going back in Aldi yesterday. Cause I made karma again last night, but it's something that I only have to really make one of. I, I don't give Shane it though. I, I chop him my chicken breast up, and put seasoning on it, put it in the oven, and he eats that. And Caitlin won't eat it, so I did make her a bacon and cheese wrap in air fryer. <laughs> so it ain't something that does actually go around everybody. I don't know why I lied to you then, but I thought it did in my head. <laughs> um, and I had some other bits on and I uh, didn't see what it was. I can't remember. I did get some claws. There were a few bits in sale. I don't know if I'm about to show you. Am I? I have no idea. I don't know what I'm talking about. I think this was night where Jacob had been acting up, if I remember right. And I was saying, I was telling you all about it, saying, ah, you know, I get loads of comments saying, oh, you super mum and stuff like that. But honestly, I'm not. And some nights I just really lose my rag. And I did that night with Jacob. And I was telling you about it. And even though I'm voicing over it, I didn't have to tell you again. I'm still telling you because it did happen. <laughs> but he were a little bugger, honestly. And he proper embarrassed me as well. But he's learnt from it and he said sorry. And it were ages ago, so I kind of forgot about it now. But, yeah, it happens, doesn't it, with kids? <sighs> Why are I showing you these claws? <laughs> what I did get it were three pairs of leggings for Millie. They're the ones that you can see. The, like, navy-coloured. Um, actually, let me see if I can, like, cut it down. There we go, I should have made it a bit shorter now and I'll show you it close. But I did get a three um, pairs. I'm not even going to show you, am I? Is this wrong clip? Right, I didn't add extra clip on. So there it is. Could have just made that a lot shorter for you. But I'm probably not going to try and even bother re-editing this because I'll be there all night. I'll never be perfect. So I usually just do this. I do whatever and I just stick it on. <laughs> but I did get Millie three pairs of leggings. you got like a mustard colour. You got that peachy colour or pinky, dusky pink, and like that charcoal colour leggings, and they've got like um, like sort of like ribbed looking, and they were frilly at bottom if I remember, or you know that kind of cut that's like a frill sort of look, 
but they're reduced to four pound i think they were and i don't think that's bad at all is it for three pairs of leggings i did get them in five for six thinking that they'd be perfect size which they do fit her but she ain't gonna you know she, she's gonna start getting a six to seven for millie i did get loy wore this yesterday it looks super cute in it i'd wanted it for ages and then when i went in and i'd seen it in nine to twelve months and it was reduced to four pound from eight I grabbed it and I, I must say I did do a bit of a nappy dance on that aisle because I couldn't believe I've got it for half price when it was something that I genuinely wanted to buy him anyway. And yeah, it just says that about hugs on front. It's got a matching hat with like little ears on it. There, look. And it's got the matching little boy leggings and I just think <laughs> they look gorgeous in that. So cute. So I'm really chuffed I got that. And then I got this for Caitlin. I did try to take a little bit of a video of her wearing it but Millie kept jumping all over her so... Because she wore it when she had a sleepover and she would just, she loved it. So you got the t-shirt, you got the stripy cardigan, the black and white stripy cardigan and then you got the black flare trousers with it. And she, she's been wearing the black flares for school. <laughs> she does look super cute with her little boots on with heel. Because I don't remember if I showed you, I did take a clip of that as well. Hang on. I think my voice went funny then because I turned it off a bit too quick. But they were, um, they're all sparkly at back and I got them reduced. I think they're £8 a pair in Asda and Millie's wore as well. Can't remember how much them little pink ones but they absolutely love it. So that'll send up the video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I have got other ones that I'm going to try to put together. A little bit of home bargains and just random bits but I won't flip be back with you properly soon. Take care all of you and yeah I'll hopefully have a video on. Hey, next couple of days. Bye.